In this video, I'm going to show you how to scale your affiliate marketing business using an anti-detect browser. So for those who don't know, an anti-detect browser is a tool that improves your privacy and helps to manage multiple social media accounts, e-commerce accounts, and ads accounts. So basically, there are numerous anti-detect browsers out there, but the one I recommend and the one I personally use is Beat Browser. So you want to click on the first link in the description and it's going to bring you to this page. And as you can see right here, Bit Browser is an expert in multi-account security management, which tells you they have advanced features and a lot of customizations which you can use to create unique profiles. And that means you can manage your accounts here without any problems. And if you scroll down, you're going to see a lot of features you are going to get from group control synchronization, proxy IP recommendation, Google Extension Center, script market, local API, and RPA browser automation. Okay, and now if you scroll to the very bottom of the page, you are going to see they are partners with a lot of platforms, including a lot of proxy providers. So as you can see right here, I have numerous profiles on this anti detect browser. And one of the cool features I like about this browser is it has this remark section, which means whenever you create any profile, you can also make notes, which is going to indicate the purpose of that profile. As you can see, this Facebook profile I created here for my ClickBank ads method, which I use to promote various affiliate offers on Facebook. All right, so you can see for YouTube as well, I also have another CPA method I'm using with this YouTube profile. So I'm going to show you how you can do everything in this video as well and scale your affiliate marketing earnings easily. So once you come over to the website, the first thing you want to do is to come over to the download section. So if you do that, it's going to bring you to this page. Here you want to then select your device type. So for me, I am using a Windows 64 bit. So I'm going to click on download for Windows. So once you do that, as you can see, the browser is going to start downloading to your device right away. So once the download is completed, all you then need to do from here is to extract this zip folder. So once you extract the folder, all you need to do is to then open the folder and you want to click on the browser. So once you click on the browser, it's going to ask you to choose a install location. For me, I'm going to leave it as default and you want to click on install. And as you can see, it's going to begin installation right away. So as you can see, the installation is now complete. All you then need to do from here is to click on finish and it's going to open the browser. So once the browser opens up, it's going to look like this. And all you need to do is to create an account so that you can log in to the browser. All you need to do is to then click on this button to create an account so once you click on that it's going to bring you back to the website and here you want to then click on sign up it's then going to bring you to this page where you then want to enter your username your password you want to then type in your email address and you want to click on get code if you do that it's going to send a code to this email address and all you need to do is to enter the code right here. You want to then come over here and select your currency of choice. And you want to make sure to then come over here and check this box and you want to click on sign up. So once you create your account, you then want to come back to the browser and you want to enter your login details and you want to click on login. So once you do that, your dashboard is going to look like this. And this is where you're going to see all the information about your account. So before we create a profile, I want to show you other features you can use on this browser. So as you can see, they have cloud phone. This means you can create a virtual phone on this browser, which can be very helpful when you're trying to verify multiple accounts. If you come over to this section, ACPA, which stands for Robotic Process Automation, this is for advanced users who know what they are doing and this is usually for automating any form of online activity all right so then you want to come over to this section that says group and if you come over to this section this is where you will be able to create multiple groups depending on whatever purpose you want to use the profiles for all right as you can see i have created a group here for facebook which means whenever i create any profile I can just put this Facebook as the group name and this is going to help you become more organized, all right? And to create a group, all you need to do is to click on add and you want to give the group a name. So let's take YouTube as an example, all right? And all I need to do from here is to click on confirm. And now if you come over to this proxy IP, this is where you are going to see a lot of IP 
and proxy providers which you can use alongside with your profiles and one of the main features and the reason i like this browser is a lot is by coming over to this extension section and if you come over here you are going to see a lot of helpful extensions which can be really helpful when using in conjunction with your profiles so if you come over to the marketing extension as an example so let's say i want to download multiple tiktok videos all i simply need to do is to come over to this extension you want to then click on settings and now i can automatically enable this extension for all browsers i create on this account or i can come over here and select specific browsers i want to use this for okay as you can see right here i have a tiktok profile here all i just need to do is to select this tiktok profile and that extension will be added to that profile automatically and once i'm done all i just need to do is to click on select so the list of the extension you can use is endless and you can click on this small button to even see more extension and now if you come over to this user section this is where you can add a virtual assistant to help you manage multiple profiles if you don't want to do all that hard work yourself and to do that you can simply come over to create a role this is going to show you all the various permissions you can give to the virtual assistant when managing your profiles okay so for me if i come over here and i want someone to manage my profiles for me all i just need to do is to click on browser profile what this means is i can add someone into my account and this person is going to be able to open my profile and perform all sort of activity on my profiles for me without doing any hard work myself and this is where you don't want to give this role a name so for me i am going to type in manager right here as an example so then you want to then click on confirm and now if you come over to this cost center this is where you'll be able to fund your account and you can use this fund to purchase any of the available plans which i'll be showing you in a moment so if i come over here and i click on recharge all i simply need to do is to enter the amount i want to add into my account so if i type in 100 dollars as an example you can see they have so many payment methods you can use to fund your account from visa to paypal to crypto and other payment options right here so all you need to do is to select a payment method of your choice and you want to click on next and doing that you'll be able to fund your account easily so once you come over to the profile section you are going to see this section that says subscribe this is where you are going to see the various plans available on beat browser as you can see right here if i want to create 500 profiles all i simply need to do is to click on this option here which i'm going to be charged 50 dollars a month and also you can see i can assign up to 12 users to help me manage my account without having to do any hard work on my end and like i showed you earlier you can use the balance in your account or you can just pay directly by selecting any of the various payment options available here and you want to then click on confirm so once you select any of the plan you want to come over to click on add and this is where you will be able to create a profile however if you want to create profiles in bulk or you want to edit profiles in bulk as you can see here you can do batch update batch add and batch import of profile however since we want to create only a single profile you want to just click on this add button so once you do that it's going to bring you to this page and this is where you want to then type in a name for your profile so for example let's say we want to create a facebook ads account so i'm just going to type in facebook ads right here you can come over here and select a group as you can see i created a facebook group earlier but this is not necessary you don't really have to do this if you don't want to okay so for me i'm going to select the facebook group and here you want to then select a platform as you can see they have numerous platforms here from social media platform to e-commerce platforms to ads platform you can basically select any of the platform right here however if the platform you are working with is not available you can come over here and select these other platforms option but since facebook is available here i'm just going to select facebook and here you can type in the username and password of your account if you want to do that then you want to come over to the remark section this is where you want to type in the purpose of this profile so like i said earlier we will be using this profile to create facebook ads for affiliate products so here you want to make sure to type in whatever remark you want depending on the purpose of that profile 
okay so once you do that you want to then scroll down this is where you then want to select a proxy you can come over and leave everything as default and use your local proxy if you want to do that or you can come over to this section and you can select any of the available proxy providers they have on this platform so basically this is up to you so once you select your proxy you want to then scroll down and as you can see these are various parameters you can tweak to your liking but i highly recommend to do this with caution and only if you know what you are doing okay however you can just leave everything as default or you can come over here and click on random fingerprint so once everything looks good you just want to click on continue so as you can see this is the profile we just created for facebook ads to promote affiliate products and all we simply need to do from here is to click on open so once you open the browser it's going to show you all the information on your browser and here is going to automatically open the facebook website for you and here you can then log into your facebook and start promoting any affiliate product of your choice and also once you're done using the browser you can come over to this more option by clicking on these three dots and you can come over here and click on close browser okay and also if you come back to this more option you can see there are numerous things you can do here as well you can update this profile if you want to do that you can clone it you can export this profile you can export cookies and you can come over to delete this profile if you want to do that as well and also if you have any questions or you are facing any problem you can always come over to the top here and reach out to the customer support of bit browser and they will be more than happy to help you out so basically this is how you can create numerous profiles on bit browser like i said you want to make sure to come over to the subscribe section and choose any of the available plans here and you can start using this to scale your affiliate marketing earnings easily